Now, moving on to P and O next. Um, this is a company with decades and decades of experience. Very British in terms of their entertainment, great food, great standards. And here to tell you more about them is, of course, our host from the Friday show. So we also always uh, have a show on Friday, don't forget, at 11 in the morning. Here is the one and only Keith Maynard. At just 77,000 tonnes, P&O Cruises Oceana may not be the biggest in the fleet, but she certainly packs a mighty punch. Fresh from her recent refitting, she was extensively and expensively refurbished and looks absolutely beautiful. Oh. You know, as a proud Englishman, the centre of my universe has always been my local pub. And on P&O's Oceania, you really won't go wrong by visiting this beautiful yacht and compass nautically themed pub, which serves up a healthy selection of Britain's best. On top of that, you can really live the high life on this ship with the bubbles of the Magnum Champagne Bar or dancing into the wee hours in the chic Le Club. Whether you choose the more traditional fixed dining of the Adriatic or the freedom dining of the Ligarian, both restaurants serve up consistently delicious food from an ever-smiling army of knowledgeable waiters. For those who prefer their dining al fresco, then why not try a super tender steak at the Horizon Grill on Deck 14? You're guaranteed great taste and even better views. Or pop along and let Marco Pierre White dazzle your taste buds at Café Jardin. Friendly and interactive, as well as diverse, Oceana offers many entertainment options, from the high-rolling fun of the Monte Carlo Club to the cabaret and comedy of Starlights. You can pop along to the atrium for a classical recital, or head here for a pint and watch your favourite team in the winner's sports bar. And then, after a great meal, go to the Footlights Theatre, where you'll be hard-pressed to believe that you're not actually sitting in the West End. Stylish and inviting, Oceana's cabins come in all shapes and sizes, from spacious and fully equipped suites like this, offering a host of extra special touches to mini suites, balcony cabins, and standard inside or outside cabins. But all come with a host of mod cons and a daily steward service, plus the all-important tea and coffee making facilities. Because if you're like me, you can't even face the rest of the world without at least one cup of coffee. I'm, I'm exactly the same. The same. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> For me, it's two, though. Yeah, it is <laughs> really. two, <laughs> two strong ones. Yeah. Um, great brand, great company. What is really nice tonight, for you to skew your place and modern to get this low price, it's only a £50 deposit, isn't it? I know, it? I mean, you know, it's just fantastic. It even it, means if your partner's not around, and you're like, I, d I want to get this at this good price, just kind of do it, secure and, it. And it is nice securing your, your cabin, uh, having it to look forward to, but you really do only have to find £50 tonight. We do know this is going to be a top side, £50 deposit. Then you can look forward to it as well. Yeah. Right, uh, lovely itinerary, because we're... First of all, flying you to Venice, and we're yes. cruising out of Venice. We are, yeah. Really nice itinerary, this. There's not one duff port on here. Uh, so we're sailing, uh, we're at sea for day two. Day three, you arrive in Montenegro in Couture. And part of the lovely thing here is actually entering the Bay of Couture. And just, just before we move on, that, those, the stills of Venice, it's one of the most beautiful ports to cruise out of. Oh, it? absolutely yeah. amazing. Yes, I mean, that's an experience in itself. It? You're right, yeah. So sailing out of Venice, into Montenegro, which will take a couple of days, and you go into the bay, and you literally glide for about an hour through the mountains on a 17-mile waterway. So it's a lovely entry into this stunning place where you've got this amazing old town and lots to go and see. And then day four, you then arrive in Corfu, which is a beautiful island. Um, I've had a few holidays there and it's just gorgeous. I love holidaying in Greece. I love the food, the people. It's always very stunning. You can go and visit the Monastery of the Virgin Mary. You've got Corfu Town. You've got a lovely little mouse island you could get a little boat over to. Day five, we're at sea. And then day six, we're arriving in Rome. And, you know, what isn't there to do in Rome? There are some musts. If you've never been to the Colosseum before or the Trevi Fountain, do go and have a look. Rome's a fabulous city for wandering around on foot. It is, isn't it? It yes. really is. Yeah, it is. And then, of course, you've got the Vatican. You've got the famous Michelangelo and the Sistine Chapel that you saw there. The I mean, Colosseum, there are, yeah, really, yeah, huge, big, iconic sites to see. 
And more besides. I love Rome. It's so beautiful. And, and as Gemma said, very accessible. The port is City Becky. You can get the train into Rome really That's easy. Right. Or, of course, there'll always be, um, say, excursions you could do, of course, as well. Yeah, another thing that Planet Cruise are great at organising as well. And then, oh, a real highlight of yeah. the moment. Yeah, so as I say, all of these places are really beautiful places to go. Monte Carlo in Monaco, talk about ending on a glamorous note. Uh, I you love know, Monte Carlo. It's the playground of the rich and famous. One of the funniest things is watching everybody with their designer shades and their amazing outfits. Just, just the cars there as the well. The cars. I know it's kind of like standard to have a Ferrari. And it's like, wow. Um, and you've got, you know, famous things like the Royal Palace. Of course, they're famous for their royal family. Um, you could go into Cannes if you wanted to. It's just you'll, feel, you'll have such fun. And then you sail into um, Genoa, disembark, transfer to the airport, and fly back to London after a really magical holiday. Do you know, when you see all of those fabulous ports there, why wouldn't you want to do a cruise when you get to see so much of the world in one holiday? Yeah. And, and just back to the ships themselves, so much to do. The standards on a cruise ship are far higher than a land holiday in general, aren't they? Far yeah, higher. Yeah, I think so. I think that the cruise lines are so competitive now as well. They know the food has got to be good, yeah. you know? It's all word of mouth. And the food, you, I mean, is, is excellent. And, and so much more is included, you know? All of your meals, remember. Um, Return flights are obviously included in this one. We can always, and this is another important reason why you should think about booking with Planet Cruise tonight. We can really, really, you know, find airports that are near to you. We can add on hotel stays. We can make holidays bespoke for you. But there you can see that if those flights from London aren't suitable, we could find them from Birmingham or Manchester. Single price is really good on this one as well. Um, some of the items will differ slightly. It may operate in reverse, just depending on the departure date. And again, a lot of you have been asking what price is it for this date or that date. So we've got a whole breakdown. Just have, have a little second to look at those. We can see really good pricing across you the know, board for, there. For me, it sounds like a funny thing. It's such a luxury to pick up a phone on a free phone number and actually have a conversation with a yeah. human being. Because I do a lot of stuff online sometimes and then I think, oh, what's that? Oh, is it right? Oh, I don't know. And it drives me mad. And then if it's not a free phone number, I'm just stressed to get oh, off the right. phone. Because yeah. you think, how much is this costing? So you can ask anything you like. And take your time. N now, um, a family of four would love that cruise and you can actually book that right now with just a deposit of £200 as well. So... You know, cruises are great for everyone. We can find your perfect cruise, whether you're single, a couple, a family, an extended family. They really will be the right cruise for you. We guarantee that with yeah. Planet Cruise. And we love the fact that tonight you can secure your cabin. You're not waiting until it's too late and all the, you know, the lower price cabins have gone or the best cabins have gone. You can secure your place on this cruise tonight for just a £50 deposit.